Hello everybody, welcome back to Godzilla Mode and today I have another great video for you guys, alright? Now in today's video, I will be showing you guys the best defense to uh, box Bunch, alright? Now we all know Bunch has made his way back into Madden as the best offense in the game. It's right up there with wide trips, alright? But Bunch, it just overpowers every other offense, alright? Even if you can't block your tight end at a certain position, it is still the meta offense. And now you can put your tight ends on slants and zigs and stuff. So this offense is easily the best in the game. But what I'm going to be showing you guys is how to stop this play out of bunch. And it is verticals. Now you might be like, okay, we know how to stop verticals, blah, blah, blah. But actually verticals is three things, like three routes, right? You got the, I'm, going to show, I'm just going to show you guys, but it's three routes you have to wear, worry for when they run verticals. Now, some people still run stock verticals just for the, the crosser and just adjust out of it and things like that nature but i'm going to show you guys how to get pressure how to stop it get interception and just make your opponent you know make it really really hard for your opponent all right and just and just how to just stop bunch all together all right so let's go ahead we are in the multiple d playbook and the uh, play we're going to be focusing on out of is a cover four quarter so right now this is the best defensive play so far to me match one in the game but i'm not going to show you guys i'm not going to be running match like that all right so go ahead and click uh coach adjustments or your right stick and then you're going to go to on, leave it on. You want to have ball and air by play ball. Quarterback matchup, leave it on back because you're not running man coverage. And aggressive, you want to have this on aggressive, all right? And then everything else, leave it like it is. Do not put match, just leave it on default, all right? And let's go ahead and come out. Oh, and then before you do that, what you guys want to do is go to substitution, right? And in the middle right here, this is what I do. So on the left side, you want to put a line back. I mean, put a safety right here. So put a safety right here. Uh, Jerry, JT Gray, and then you want to put a linebacker right here. So let's put Demir Davis. And I'm going to show you guys why. And then, and then you just want to have your best corners in the game. And then at this spot right here, this is a very key. So this spot right here, you want to have a cornerback. So let's put Brad, uh, Lante Taylor. He's very fast. And let's put Marcus. Actually, put Marcus May right here. And then always have your best pass rushers in the game. That's no. That's probably going to be that default, right? And then let's go ahead and come out of cover four quarters. And let's come out under play right here. Verticals, right? So the main thing you want to look out for is number 18, which is the cross route, A, uh, A, which is 85, which is the wheel route, and then it's another wheel route, which is uh, uh, number 11, which is the outside B receiver, right? So this is how you do it. Do not press. Do not press. When they run a bunch, do not press unless you're trying to blitz them. But if you're not blitzing them, do not press. So go ahead, especially in regs, all right? So go ahead and press Y or triangle if it's on PlayStation, baseline, and then this, this is what you want to do. Bring this guy down. This is why I say put a fast cornerback up top right here. Because 90% of the time, your opponent is running bunch to the right side. They usually, I mean, I won't say it's rare, but they do really do not run bunch to the left side, all right? So what I do, I bring them down right here. Just to where to see where the line the, the lineman is right here. I bring them just down right there, right? And then I put this guy, I met him up with the, um, with the RB receiver, right? And I'm going to show you guys why. And then A... I mean, then you want to, um, not A, but you want to put uh, blitz your user, my fault. You want to blitz your user, then you want to put slant outside, right? And press RB, pass commit. And now this will help with coverage and getting pressure on the QB. Now watch the defense, right? Watch the defense. Watch the defense. Watch it. Watch A. Watch the halfback. Nothing's open. That's my interception. Like I said, this defense, it bags it, all right? Now I'm going to go to replay right quick so I can show you guys, all right? Because... Let's go really look at it, right? So, boom, they snap it. Now, the reason why I have my user right there is just to look like I am blitzing them, but I'm really not, all right? And then, as you guys can see, pressure, I mean, it did come in, but it didn't. So, there's, you don't have to take some time for that. And the reason why I did come over here to run with this route is because you want to just run right until he just don't throw it. And the reason why you bring this guy down, the cornerback, is just in case I all run like a streak in any bomb plays. He will, um, the RB will be man up and I will have coverage. And then with a, a good linebacker or even a safety, you can have a safety up there if you want to, but I have to have a linebacker in and a safety on either side doesn't really matter just so I can stop with the run, all right? Just in case they do run the ball. And then right here, you should be able to pick this off underneath if he does throw it. And then as you guys can see, verticals, he does have his halfback on the route. And I'm going to show you guys how to stop that, right? So as you guys can see, the interception that was there. So go ahead and base the line again. Set up into D line side outside. No, bring this guy down number eight to 18, right? And then you uh, now you're on the user, but put this guy, man him up with A, and then bring this guy right here, and then pass commit again. Now, let me bring this guy down just a little bit more, right there. Boom. So then I look like it's like man coverage, like right? Wait for him to snap it. Boom. 
boom, nothing's open. The cross is not open. Nothing. Pressure comes in. He tried to throw it, and he get pressure, and it's incomplete. So that's box. That's perfect defense. Let's go look at it one more time, right? So boom, you go to snap it. Now as you guys see, now he can't throw this to A, but that's very risky. I have a cornerback right there, and I have this guy Marcus Smith, which is a safety, right? And the reason I have 27 right there, now, now you guys can see, even they do try to throw a bomb, my guy is right there, right? And the reason why I like this so good is because now I check the halfback, and then pressure comes in. Four man rush, usually somebody's gonna come in, all right? And then boom, he throws it. He tried to throw it to the crosser, which end up getting matched, and he cannot throw it. And it's incomplete. So this is, like I said, perfect defense. Now the only time you do um, uh, press, right? You know, go ahead, um, press like this. The only, the only time you want to do that is go ahead and blitz this guy, and then put the outside guy on like a hard flat, and then use it, this guy, and then put this guy on a deep half. But the only thing wrong with this, you have to send the heat, and then you have to use it the whole middle of the field right here, right? That's the only problem, but you should be good, all right? So wait for him to snap it. Wait for him to snap it. Now nah, you're good, you're good, you're good. Watch the middle, watch the middle, you're good. And they throw to the halfback, but pressure came in, which forced him to throw the ball out really, really fast, all right? Let's look at it one more time and see what was, if anything was open besides the halfback, right? So boom, we come in, but well, actually my user was horrible. I should have stayed it just a little bit longer. And then as you guys can see, the guy, oh, he actually did come, he did actually did get pressure on him, but it, like they both like looped, they weren't supposed to do that. So let's go do one more time. Uh, number yeah no yeah leave that guy right there my fault and then blitz that outside guy hard flat deep half set outside pass commit blitz this guy right here me your user right here wait for him to snap it wait for him to snap it you're good you're good you're good nothing's open the halfback and pressure comes in and it's incomplete another time so this is the best defense to back bunch you can adjust out of it as many times as you need to because they will box it like i said you can send heat out of it you can man uh fake man press out of it it's going to match to any receiver all right and uh yeah so make sure you guys like comment and subscribe check out my patreon link down below and i will see you guys in the next video peace